Good morning. My name is Jim, and you have found the Deep Energy Daily Affirmation for Friday, July 5th. How's everybody doing out there? Hope everybody is well. If you're in the U.S. and we just had the 4th of July, hopefully you still have all your fingers and toes after all the fireworks stuff yesterday. <laughs> um, please like, subscribe, hit the bell, hit the screen, whatever it is, just to let the algorithm know that you were here and that you enjoyed the content. So that would be greatly appreciated, and I thank you in advance. It's a beautiful morning here. It's a little cloudy, but the temperature's rising, which I love. And I actually like the humidity, too. I'm one of those crazy heat people that I love humidity. I love the heat. Um, and New Hampshire gives a lot of it <laughs> in July and August, for sure. So I am in the right place, at least for two months, anyway. Um, yeah, the, the birds are out. Um, you maybe can hear the roosters and the chickens way up the road a little bit. I can hear them, so. But I hope you can hear the nature around. It's very, very calming. So let's take a deep breath and relax. Maybe two deep breaths, because it's been a morning so far. The taking of a deep breath, I should do that more. And maybe you should do it more too. It, it does clear your mind, and I wish I really knew why. <laughs> I'm sure I can read up on it, but um, just doing that a couple of times, I don't want to say it sets your mind free, but it just brings you back for a moment. So... Um, I'm going to say, I'm going to repeat this morning's Deep Energy Daily Affirmation five times. I let go of the need to compare myself to others. I let go of the need to compare myself to others. I let go of the need to compare myself to others. I let go of the need to compare myself to others. And I let go of the need to compare myself to others. I am one of the most guilty person and people in the world with this, for sure. Um, as a musician and a creative, um, I'm always comparing myself in the content that I put out with other people. Um, it's nerve wracking. It eats at you and like just for an example and i'm sure everybody can apply this to their own life i'll put out a video on youtube of some music and um it gets however many views it gets a couple hundred is usually where where i hang out in the youtube land sometimes more sometimes less you know and somebody puts out you know i put out an hour of like just music to listen to while you study or whatever. And then I go look at somebody else's video and it's, you know, it's in the same genre. And they have like 500,000 views in a day. And I'm like, why am I, not, why is that not happening to me? I have to let go. <laughs> Seriously, as a creative, as a musician, you're always comparing yourself to people who are more successful. And it eats at you. I know it, it did because I try not to, but it does. And, you know, this is a really good one for me because I need to repeat that to myself because when I go back into my studio and make music today and look at my figures and numbers um, of what I've done this week, I'm like... Well, this person has 20,000 views and I have 500. You know, and then you say, what am I doing wrong? And it, again, this applies to like your office job, you know, relationships. Why does this person have a partner and I don't? Why am I going through a divorce? You know, wh why? And those people seem so happy. 
why did I get the bad relationship? You know, on top of everything else that you're trying to do to be productive and to, you know, get through the day, getting down on yourself on top of it, it's just, it's t- that's hard. That is hard. And it is hard to let go, to just sort of just look straight ahead and not look to the sides and see what everybody else is doing. Um, and that's sort of why I picked this morning's um, affirmation because I know how hard it is for me to let go. Um, I feel like I'm trying to do better at it, but then something just sort of pops up and I'm going, damn, you know, and you look at how other people are successful and then you go, why am I not that successful? Why did that person get the raise? Why did that person get the promotion? You know? And for me, it's just like, I need to, you know, look at how I do things and, you know, Can I put a little more effort into something? Can I try a little harder? You know? But that's working on me. That's not saying this, you know, what was this person's process? You know, work on yourself. I have to work on me. Because nobody else is going to. You know? You you are in this for you. You know, you this is your life. You want to make the best of it. And you, you know, and we all want as less stress as possible. And just comparing yourself to somebody else is just adding the stress up. So please try to remember that. I let go of the need to compare myself to others. And I am going to repeat this today for sure. Because I've already looked at my emails this morning. And I know <laughs> that I need to do that. So, um, so yeah. I let go of the need to compare myself to others. Because you're enough. You are enough. I am enough. I don't need to be worried about what this person did or what that person did. I'm just going to worry about me. So, there you go. Please remember those words this morning, this afternoon, this evening, maybe before you go to sleep at night. I I sincerely am going to repeat this to myself a couple of times today because I know I have to. And I don't want extra stress in my life. Um, please remember that the world needs you, cares for you, and loves you. And the world is a much, much, much better place with you in it. Please don't ever think that the world, um, does not need you. Because it does. I need you. Me. I need everybody out there watching. And I would... And I don't want any of you people to go away. So (laughs) please, please, please remember that you are full of worth and that you are important. And we need you here on this planet Earth. So thank you. Weekend coming up. I hope everybody has an amazing weekend. I hope you get to do something that you like. You get to either be introverted, sit, watch some TV, read a book, listen to some music. Um, I think I'm not doing a whole lot of anything. At least I'm going to try not to. I'll be working, but I think the only real solid plans I have this weekend is I'm taking tango lessons with my wife. And um, those are on Saturday night, and that's actually pretty fun. Um, But that's pretty much the only thing I have actually scheduled on the calendar. So... um, I hope that everybody has as much fun or as much time to themselves or do whatever you like to do this weekend and and enjoy. And I will be speaking with everybody on Monday. So please take care. Please be kind. Peace. Bye.